Hello friends, welcome to English with Richly. In the video, English Grammar and Exercises 3 book, Unit 3, The Defective Verbs, There are a few verbs which do not have three parts or tenses and forms made from these parts. They are called defective verbs. The word defective means not complete. One of these defective verbs is can, negative cannot, which we learn to use in book 1, lesson 28. It has no stem and no past participle. It has the present form can and cannot, which are used as helping verbs with the stem of other verbs, for example, I can speak English, but I cannot speak Russian. Tom can swim, but his little brother can't swim. In the second sentence, it is not necessary to repeat the verb stem swim. It is better to say, Tom can swim, but his little brother can't. Silla verbs, three parts, the tense, alladhu forms, irukkadhu. And the Mariana verbs are defective verbs. And the defective verbs are the meaning. Complete, Puranam illada, not complete. Defective verb la ondu, can, negative form cannot. Mudiyum, mudiyadhu. The can, cannot, helping verb are used panna padudhu. Example, I can speak English, ennal, angilam pesa mudiyum. But, I cannot speak Russian, anal, ennal, Russian pesa mudiyadhu. Tom can swim, Tom mal, neenda mudiyum. But, his little brother can't swim. Anal Avana the Surya Sahodaranal Nin the Mudyadu. Second sentence of Patamanda Tom can swim, but his little brother can't swim. In the sentence la swim in reward repeat panama irkra the kaha nang in the valila sentence alam. Example Tom can swim, but his little brother can't. Can has also a past form could, negative short form couldn't. Which we use when we are speaking about past time. Can under the past form could ahavum, could in a negative form couldn't ahavum amayum. Example verbs Tom couldn't swim two years ago, but now he can. I could walk 10 miles a day when I was a young man, but now I can't. Mary couldn't go to school yesterday because she was ill. Ahmed could answer the teacher's question yesterday, but he can't answer the same questions today. Complete the following sentences which couldn't and the right verb stem. Stem verbs buy, climb, finish, find, hear, sleep. There was a lot of noise in the street last night and I dash. There was a lot of noise in the street last night and I couldn't sleep. Bob sat at back of the class and he dashed the teacher. Bob sat at the back of the class and he couldn't hear the teacher. Mary looked everywhere for her watch but she dashed it. Mary looked everywhere for her watch but she couldn't find it. The wall was very high and the thief dashed over it. The wall was very high and the thief couldn't climb over it. She was a poor woman and she dashed shoes for her children. She was a poor woman and she couldn't buy shoes for her children. Tom had a lot of homework yesterday and he dashed it. Tom had a lot of homework yesterday and he couldn't finish it. Complete the following sentences with could or couldn't and the right verb stem. Stem, answer, bite, work, have, light, serve, see, travel. People dashed by air 200 years ago. People could travel by air 200 years ago. Mr. Green dashed any money because he had a large family. Mr. Green couldn't serve any money because he had a large family. The old man is almost blind 
but he dashed well when he was young. The old man is almost blind, but he could see well when he was young. The doctor dashed a holiday last year because he was too busy. The doctor couldn't have a holiday last year because he was too busy. I had no matches, so I dashed a fire. I had no matches, so I couldn't light a fire. The questions were easy, and all the pupils dashed them. The questions were easy, and all the pupils could answer them. The old dog dashed because it had no teeth. The old dog couldn't bite because it had no teeth. The carpenter dashed 10 hours a day before he became ill. The carpenter could work 10 hours a day before he became ill. The second defective verb which we will speak about in this lesson is must. Negative short form mustn't. Must and mustn't are present form which are used as helping verb in the stem of other words. For example, you must always tell the truth, you mustn't tell lies. Must and rather a defective verb in the must and a negative form mustn't. Must and rather kattayam. You must always tell the truth. Ni appoludum unmai solla vendum. You mustn't tell lies. Ni poi solla koodadu. Must has no past form of its own. The past is expressed in this way. Had plus two stem. Must in a past form had plus two stem. Here are some examples. Jack had to get up very early yesterday. Mr. Smith had to work hard when he was young. There was no bus or taxi, so I had to walk. The teacher was late, so the pupils had to wait. Ali had to leave school when he was 14 and go to work. Complete the following sentences which are all about past time with had and the right to stem of these verbs. To stem, to buy, to help, to learn, to run, to stay, to wear. Tom dashed to school because he was late. Tom had to run to school because he was late. I lost my watch a week ago and I dashed another one. I lost my watch a week ago and I had to buy another one. Ahmad dashed French when he went to France. Ahmad had to learn French when he went to France. The sick man dashed in hospital for three months in 1961. The sick man had to stay in hospital for three months in 1961. The poor boy had only one pair of shoes so he dashed them every day. The poor boy had only one pair of shoes, so he had to wear them every day. When Mary's mother was ill, Mary dashed her at home. When Mary's mother was ill, Mary had to help her at home. To stem, to do, to punish, to stand, to swim, to take off, to write. I dashed three letters yesterday evening. I had to write three letters yesterday evening. The teacher dashed Bob because he was always late. The teacher had to punish Bob because he was always late. The tourists dashed their shoes when they visited the mosque. The tourists had to take off their shoes when they visited the mosque. There were not enough chairs in the room, so some people dashed. There were not enough chairs in the room, so some people had to stand. The bridge was broken and the traveler dashed across the river. The bridge was broken and the traveler had to swim across the river. Jack dashed a lot of homework yesterday. Jack had to do a lot of homework yesterday. Thanks for watching.